There is a great new worship song called The Blessing that was released by Carrie Job, Cody Carnes, and Elevation Worship. If you have not listened to it yet, we highly recommend it. It's based on a prayer that we find in the book of Numbers, and it reads like this. The Lord bless you and keep you. Most of us know that the Lord blesses us, but do you also know that the Lord is keeping you today? No matter how you feel, no matter what you've been going through, the Lord is keeping you. He is preserving you, protecting you because you belong to him. Ravi Zacharias, an amazing Christian writer and evangelist who went home to be with the Lord just last week, he said this, the most important question is not who you are, rather, it is about whose you are. Friend, you belong to the Lord and he is keeping you today. Next part of this prayer. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. Think back to earlier in the life of Moses when he had an encounter with the Lord on the summit of a mountain called Sinai. The Lord appeared to Moses and it was such a powerful encounter that Moses' face was literally shining afterwards. Think about this. If the Lord's face is shining on you, it means that he is very close to you. It's about proximity. The Lord is not far from you today. He is not absent from your life. He is near, he is close, and he's not empty-handed. He brings grace to you today. He brings undeserved favor to you and for you. The last part of this prayer. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. The word countenance is another name word for face. You can tell a lot about how someone feels about you when you can see their face. The Lord is lifting up his face on you today. In other words, the Lord is smiling in your direction. He is pleased with you today and he accepts you because of your faith in the finished work of Jesus. There is nothing holding you back today, nothing blocking you from receiving the peace that he has for you. And friend, the peace that he brings you is special. It's not the absence of problems, not the absence of difficulty. Instead, it's the promise that the Lord will be with you through every circumstance that you go through. If you fully surrender control of your life to him, he will be right there with you every day, no matter what. You will find a peace in the storm, a calm in the chaos. So we pray this powerful prayer of blessing over you and your life today. We speak this over you, your family, your friends, and everyone around you. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord lift his face upon you and give you peace.